I'm back. It's pretty funny. It's pretty funny. So like... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. So we were... I think we're looking for the boss. Okay, wait a second. Do you see those three rooms on the side? I think the three rooms on the side. Didn't Chris, wait, so Chris I think said, and don't get me wrong, well, okay, I'm in a different part of the building than I thought I was. So, Chris, right? Does Chris watch the movies? I don't know. All right, Adam, we're going to go talk to the guy that looks just like your dad. Then, if that doesn't work, we're gonna go talk to, I think, well, I think this is Chris's office. Or is it your dad's office? It's pretty funny that his name's Peter on top of it. Oh. Ella? Meg Rainman speaking. Meg? It's Jack. It's Jack. Jack. What's wrong? Did something happen? Did something ever happen? So many things have happened, I'm confused. I see. I called because I had something on my mind. What's wrong? Apparently there is a connection between the chief and the lab of the lab over there and the computer program called Ring. What do you mean? Yeah, I'm not sure if that program has anything to do with all this. But last year in Japan, apparently there was an incident con concerning a video called Ring. That incident was a strange story. I know about that story. I read a report about that in this lab. And a copy of the video, which is supposedly the reason, is currently in my possession. What? I, I see. Well, that makes it easy to explain. Do you also know about Sadoko Yamamura? the supposed creator of that video? Roughly, yes. What do we know about her? They tied in the probably has smallpox, right? Because she made a video and there's a video transmitted virus that they've been mistaking for smallpox. So that part makes sense. And they did, they did reference it. We don't know the powers. We're figuring those out, that's obvious. But the third bullet point. She supposedly had some supernatural powers. This is the second bullet point with the supernatural powers. And could curse people to death, right? Yeah, it's about, that's about it. But anyway, that Sadoka, uh, Sadoko Yamamura, she's over there at the lab. What? You're kidding. Why would Sadoko Yamamura be over here? That's the connection with the lab chief that I mentioned earlier. Your chief showed a strange amount of interest. He used the authority of CDC to pull out the corpse. I still have more. After all the incidents concerning Ring in Japan, the curse changed shape into a virus and caused another epidemic in Japan, a virus. All the information can be confirmed. Meg, for this case, 
Don't associate yourself anymore with Ring. This is beyond a bad feeling. You know that it's too late. What? That was Yasako? Yamamura or whatever. Sadako? Yamamura. Jack, Jack, the phone is dead. Pardon me, Meg Rain Man. Your? What does a security guard want with me? I'm sorry, but it's the chief's order. We need to hold you down for a while. Please come with me. Hold me. Did they find out I have an 8mm film? I took from the reference room? Now, come with me. You're kidding. At a time like this? Alright, I'll come with you. Then to the hallway. I have to watch this 8mm film at least. I understand. Hey, wait! Where do you think you're going? Wait! Wow. See, see why I don't really understand what's happening in these, um, in this sequence of events? I keep getting lost in this game. No time to waste here. So, I stole an 8mm film. What a coat tree, what a nice and neat. Why isn't that my office if I'm under strict orders not to go on the computers? Why would my office even have a computers? I need to watch this freaking... this Chris's office? Or is this my office? Okay, this is the room I just walked into. The ring terrors are all? Makes me have to itch my lip. Wow, okay, so I need a key to the audio-visual room. We're back on track. What? Nothing here. Maybe... Locker room? I gotta start using the Y button to look at these signs on the door. Why wouldn't it be here? Or is that the staircase? Sorry, staircase. We don't talk about how that staircase is. Staircase?
I need to find this woman named Christine. Her name is Chris. Chris, Chris. Chris, Chris, Chris. The control room. Chris. Chris, where is your office? This room's kind of intense in the real world. Yeah, I'll have some of that. Oh, a map. Yeah, I'll have some of that. So... Alright, what? I have to remember what I said 30 seconds ago? Is there a way to turn off this delay? <laughs> have you ever been in a room with a camera pointed at you? Confused, but not about the camera being pointed at you? Ah. Uh. Let's just, just take a look. It's crazy. It's like the ring is this CDC office. The actual building itself is so similar to the ring game. Does that mean that it's based on the real world in this game? Or did they just take it easy on you? So, maybe, hold on, maybe I gotta go to the basement. Where the heck is, where the heck is Chris's office? I have already failed to remember where Chris's office was. Little did I know it would be an important part. Like, they have like eight music tracks, and they're all incredibly climactic. Lab first. Lab second. Lab third. Lab four. Audio visual room. Okay. I wish these rooms had name tags on the map, to be honest.
What? What did? Where the fuck am I going, Adam? It's not Sea of Thieves, am I right? Am I right? Because navigating in Sea of Thieves is... Fun bismal. Honestly, you feel pretty good when you figure it out. Yeah, that's a uh, clever game. Oh, God. That's my boss's room. So, I'm beginning to think. Don't get scared of the suggestion. I'm beginning to think it's in the basement. S O T is all. Man, navigation wise. Navigation wise, you think it's bad? Dun, dun, dun. Let's go to the basement. I would live in the basement after that. I think I, I think I hear a voice coming from my vent. Yeah, what is that coming from that vent? Sounds like a vent. Caught my attention for a while. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, this looks like the office of none other than... This game would be so much more fun if an expert was playing it. Why aren't I an expert in the ring terrors round? I'm beating myself up because I am not an expert at the ring terrors round. Just kidding, guys. If you couldn't tell, I was faking it. I am an expert. This is just how long the game normally takes to, to go forward. This is the second time. I played this about as much as I played Enemy Zero, and that counted as a blind run to me. Enemy Zero? More like... No, there's at least one guy out there. Oh, let me rephrase that. There's at least one person out there. I feel like with this game being like, putting this ghost's female testicular syndrome on blast like that, I have to be like... I have to speak right for the, for the sake of, you know... 
I gotta make up for how bad this game. <laughs> this, if they just never bring that up again, they're like, what would be the most shocking thing to put in to there? Oh, I think he just said something that's clearly not true. <laughs> Every game is someone's favorite game. I don't know if that's true. I think the only true thing about that statement could possibly be. Okay. How the heck do you find this? This basement is the one that I hate. What is it on the left? Cause down is the breeding room, right? Operation room, middle. See, that's the thing. I know this map. There's just, there's, there's two offices right there. Maybe would you call those offices? Would you call these offices? Sorry, sir. I wouldn't call those in offices. Whoa, this one's got a opera room. Offices? Excuse me, offices. I'd like to ask you, so where's the offices? Excuse me, sir. Can you point me to the direction of the offices? I would like to see every single one of your very fine employees working. So I can evaluate and survey this company to give it a reward. They call me. An office surveyor. I survey offices. So these are... Two rooms. I gotta say, maybe the ring tears realm. I'll take a look in here. This can't, this can't be, um. Yeah. Excuse me. Have you seen Christine's office? Sir, can you help me, sir? I seem to be having trouble finding her sneeze opposite. I'll go upstairs one. Fuck it, we've looked at the first floor, what, six times? I've been in every room six times. What's, what's it gotta be? The last room that I look in every time? Or is there a good chance I'm about to walk into Christine's offices? Oh, hello. That's the great outdoors. That can't be an office. Transmission? I think one fifteen transmission is the power room. I thought transmission was a TV broadcasting room because I'm pretty sure that Chris is 
offices. Uh, excuse me, mates. I am trying to get into one of these offices. <laughs> I think it was like. I think it, was, it looked like it was like 15 bucks or I, th I bet it's like 40 bucks. Right. I can't tell with how you worded that, that question. It sounds like you're like, this game is expensive. And you're like, didn't know but you looked it up and you're surprised but this the just the question marks makes me think oh my god Chris do you have a minute Chris Meg what what's wrong she hasn't heard the chief's orders to hold me down. I have an eight mil me film. I don't want, I want to see. Is there any place where I can watch it? An eight millimeter film? Oh, I think you can watch it in the audio visual room in the second floor. There's a key somewhere around here. You should take it. A key, where is it? I got mixed up whose voice I'm saying like that. <laughs> Dreamcast games, am I right? Wow, look up the expendables on Dreamcast. That's like the cheapest, most garbage looking Dreamcast game I have. Well, either it's the this room or the next. It was somewhere around here. Well, at least in that case. Dang. I used to get half off at the last job. I paid $7.50 for this bad boy. I'm a little busy. Oh, I will say. Not everyone's perfect. Da -da. No cover art. But I wouldn't buy that box. If it's $100, I wouldn't pay like more than $10 for that box. But I would sell that. <laughs> I'm a little busy, so can you look for it yourself? Thanks. Then I'll look for it now. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Oh my god. The key is actually just floating in this perfect spot. with the case oh ebay i don't wanna be looking stuff up on ebay on stream i think it might be an awkward look but i'm shocked this game is expensive so what is it like like 50 60 bucks for the disc For the dicks in the back art, it's 60. I mean, that's probably what I'd put this one at. It's like disc in back art, you know what I'm saying? Unless they have... That is kind of like crazy that even these games that are kind of like feel like they should be major just major like why would you play this I guess it's got to be for the people who um who, who like played Resident Evil and they want to play more of the same like pre Resident Evil 4 type of game you know what I mean because after Resident Evil 4 Resident Evil changed drastically this is really this is what I would expect from 
Resident Evil. You know? See, now that I'm getting some direction, I kind of know where I'm going. Oh yeah, let's, let's see. The Expendables. I wonder what's on it. Though, I don't want to be cursed to death. Oh, yikes. Oh, yikes. Was the footage? Was the footage from the Ring VHS tape? The footage from the Ring Terror's Realm in the movie? Wait a second. This might be a Ring Super Fan Person game. Wait, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to look into that. Cause if they, oh, I'm still hurt. I, I got some health packs, health packs. Oh my God. I have to get to the breeding room. I'd like to go downstairs. I have a way out, you know. Maybe it's called Expendable. A beep. No, I need... I need the breeding room. We remember where the breeding room is, right? Put some items in the in the box in the breeding room. I know where we're at. I know where we're at, alright everybody? I'm on track. I'm on track. I'm on track. Don't you dare be uh, right inside of that room. Yes. I'm checking the VMU and I'm gonna overwrite the game on the first slide and I'm gonna go to the breeding room whistling into a microphone I don't think I've ever heard anyone do it, so I'm like... 
It must be borderline unthinkably bad sounding. If no one's done it in front of me. There's a glare on the tube TV. Okay, I hope this works how I think it might work. That was my only hope, right? I can't believe I've wasted all my healing. What does that even mean? Just, just hanging out. No, <laughs> no resources to my name. Not a microscope room. Not a microscope room. Haunted room. Haunted room. The microscope room was right across the way. See how? Creep that. So I thought of something funny yesterday, and I don't know if I said it as a joke, but you know how I got sunburn? Kind of, like I have like very mild, like my skin is red. My skin My skin is red. Yeah, so... God, what? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. I've worked my way into a corner in this playthrough. Okay. If it's not too bad, even as a prototype, the force of This game needs a lot more ugly cutscenes. It's killing me that only the opening had these like horrendous ugly cutscenes. Yeah. It's literally killing me right now. Huh. Oh, you serious? 
Just spawn with one on me? Eesh. I'm in the danger zone. See all that white area? I'm just going for it. Let's see. Let's take a look. So the ring terrors realm. Oh, hell yeah, it worked. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, you. Hurry up and give the... Get the launcher and the grenade. Me, huh? Yeah, who else is there? Just hurry up. Grenade launcher. Where in the world is such a thing? There are grenades in the kitchen on the first floor. As for the launcher, I think it was in that warehouse in the annex. Okay, we know what to do. I gotta say. At least the zombie, like if I had health packs and could run a normal speed, you know how easy that this game would be right now? But instead, I saved when I was about to freaking die and I can't find a health pack. I'm about to go to the lunchroom for the first time. There's certainly a guy right there. I remember where the kitchen is. Might not seem like I should with how lost I am all the time. Grenade launcher. Guess what it is, Jelly Plus? Give me that, Jelly. Give me that, heal. I'm gonna use it, and now I'm better. Thank goodness. Oh, the kitchen is now an unlocked door right here. I'm gonna at least get the grenades from the kitchen and then I'm gonna save. I'm, I'll be real with you. That's gotta be them. Nope, it's a small battery. Grenades in the kitchen? What is this, Lil Wayne's house? So I'm supposed to shoot these with the launcher. Did I just skip past where they said, so they're all on the first floor, right? I need a map, need a map, need a map. 
Is it that on the right? Those are bathrooms on the one side. Okay. See, I don't want to get so greedy that I just get smacked by a freaking demon. Ooh. I do want... I have a mighty need for a small key. I've got a hankering for keys. Whoa, whoa, is this the classic rat -a -tat -tat? Damn, you have to be a, a very particular angle. I got two demon monkey in my jacuzzi. And grenades in the fridge. What'd you guys think of the worst Lil Uzi or Lil Wayne impression ever? I got two monkeys and I think they're in my fridge with some grenades. Uh, hide your kids. I got two monkeys two monkeys hey what's up demon monkey hiding in my closet that door is sealed off oh. Yes. Remember this door? I need to equip the sh the shotgun item. Yes. The shotgun is my key. Oh, they gear gate you by literally. I ought to hit, hit the creators of this game over the back of the head. No, I'm just kidding. It's not their fault. They gear gated that bathroom door by making it so you can only shoot down doors. That are metal with probably a rocket launcher. This is the power room though. They did manage to make some actual disturbing... Is this a freaking light switch? <laughs> My inventory is full. Get the heck out of here. Sure. 
I need assault rifle ammo. We are really close to a save point. So they said that they're both on all right, the first floor. Got the grenades from the kitchen. So that's the kitchen on the right, little room on the left. Power room down. So maybe I could go... The door is locked at that end of the hallway. Let's see this room. No. Wait a second. Does the capsule room place count as the first floor? I don't no. I'm a, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. Oops, power room. So okay, here's the plan. Go down the basement steps. Once down the basement steps. We then will go. All the way back to the capsule room. Climb up the ladder. You like that? Stealth. Stealth. I'm getting ready for Metal Gear Solid 3. Snake Eater. Did I get that one right? What? <laughs> that guy was sick. The one that got scared and just ran in a little circle. That guy was funny. Okay, this game... There's my ladder. Yes. 
Yes, you got that one right. What did I get right? I'm I'm drawing a blank on what I said when you when that you're saying you got that right too. Uh. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Adam, for keeping track. Uh, Metal Gear Solid is, in fact, Snake Eater. Thank God. Oh wait, I could just refill my shotgun, right? Hell yeah. Now all my shotguns are in my shotgun. Now I'm here. <laughs> now I'm here to really just sound uh, find out. What what are those three bullets to? Grenade. All right, I need to go. I can't be lazy here. I need to actually go over here. Go down the steps. Put my handgun in storage. SMH, item management fail, am I right? X, D. Let's, let's, let's just take a moment. And it all fell apart. Never meant to be, never meant to be, never meant to me. I gotta say... Now that I have a grenade launcher... And an assault rifle... I'm not that scared. I look like Matthew Frewer. Let's not forget. I had to see I had to see the man himself. Help me remember who, who where I came from. Never meant to be, never meant to mean, never meant to think. 
So we got the hopping jackals. That's what I'm gonna call that one we just passed. Then we have the walking the walking wallabies. Then we have the slinking lizards. All right, fine, I'll do it. Even if it gets me, that's how I'm going to die. What are you saying? I'm anyway. I'm trying to go forget load the grenades. Sorry, I was reading so fast. I know it could have been hard to understand unless you are accustomed to listening to professional speed readers. I read as fast as Nicki Minaj. Jesus Christ, that guy just took, did a number to me. Looks like it's over. You saved us. Looks like it's over. You've got to be kidding me. What are you doing? Don't get so mad. I was battling it out with the guys outside. The guys outside? The guys outside. Yeah, you saved us. I'll take care of the rest of them. If you're done, help the guys on the upper floors. Upper floors? There's something up there. Yeah, there seems to be quite a number of enemies. And they're having trouble. Take a breather. And then get to helping them. You really know how to use people. Alright. Sorry I have to ask, but we're counting on you. I need a health pack! Metal Gear Solid 3 is... Snake Eater. Snake Eater. Help the guys on the upper floor. So you have to help the guys on the upper floor. That's what you're telling me. All right, I'm gonna hobble all the way back to the room where you... Okay, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna explore this unexplored area hoping to find health. These damn doors, they're sealed off. Ding, 
Damn, damn. Like, how far do you... Oh my god. That lesser demon. This is tense. That was so freaking close. Health pack. Health pack. He health pack, please. Please, I'm dying here. Can I? Uh, so much, so much, and so much, um, enemy in the toilet humor here. My nose feels so crusty right now. Let's see where to go. We've got a demon hissing at our door. Um, I think. The it's indicating Shoot at the ground, yo! Unbelievable. I can't believe this. Inconceivable. I'm out of ammo. Out of health packs. Probably use like 900 health packs. God, where was I even? It's not too bad, even as a prototype, the force of Sadako. It's unlikely to be a homicide case. We'll get to the bottom of this. Virus, what? What are you talking about, Chief? Yeah, I think we're just gonna have to do it that way. Oh my god. This game, if you could believe it, I'm actually, like, 
I'm looking at it. I just I pulled it up, you know. I think I'm actually pretty much right at the end. Like, ah, the monster escaped, Meg, let's go. No, you must equip yourself first. <laughs> there is a grenade launcher and the uh, assault rifle. Yeah, find them and come back. You know what I mean? Go to the first floor, enter the kitchen, find the assault rifle, then get a grenade launcher. Go back to the cop. Enter the room and kill the monster by using your grenade launcher. All the bullets. Then the cop says that he is going to the first floor now. You can visit the two isolation rooms and find a lot of bullets and serums. You can also find some batteries. Now save and climb to the first floor. That's where I was. You discover serums. You also... The cop says that the bullets. It's not too bad, even as a prototype. The force. How is this game so short but so long? Well, it's unlikely to be a homicide case. We'll get to the bottom of this. Virus, what? What are you talking about, Chief? I have like two segments left to this game. That's wild. I'm going to take another brief break before restarting it. I'll be right back. Or, you know what, for tonight, I think it's been enough. I think it's been enough. How much did I actually do in this game? Oh, maybe like a paragraph like this big? That's how much I did today? Golly. Yesterday, it looks like I actually did a fucking ton. But today, I didn't do a ton, I wouldn't say. But tomorrow we'll know to grab where to grab a freaking rocket launcher and grenade launcher. Have it open up the thing, the world for us a little more. Save in. Too bad, even as a prototype, the force of Sadako. Uh. Virus, what? What are you talking about, Chief? Yeah, I think we're just gonna have to do it that way. I'm Meg. Please, you have to help me. This game is wild. This, it's like, this is, this walk, the walkthrough I found is like so vague. You discover that the cop is Jack. He has learned how to play the network. Wow, spoiler on accident. I guess it's not that vague.
Holy crap. Ugh. No, I will not. I will not be defeated. I will actually take a small break and then 